My name is Lisa Stone. I teach eighth grade ELA history at Bullis Charter School. So being in the middle school grades, we have our kids for less time than those in the elementary school grades where it's self-contained and they have their kids all day. So I don't have that face time that K-5 teachers have. And so what it's provided me to, uh, the opportunity to do is engage with my kids, not that I do it 24 hours a day, but the ability to engage with them back and forth at any time that works for me and as well as for them, vice versa. So I'm able to provide feedback from them or feedback to them whenever it's convenient for me and they can do the same. They'll often upload evidence from home after the school day. And so that's really made things a lot easier. Whereas in the past, I used to have to see them to get evidence of where they are in terms of their goals. And now it, it can just be done whenever, which makes my job a lot easier, that's for sure. So it used to be that we would have designated fresh grade time where the whole class would be accessing it all at once, um, which was a bit artificial. Um, and so it's become much more of an everyday occurrence as needed by students. So if I'm handing back work or we're talking about a specific task we did, all I'll need to say to cue the kids is, so any of you who have goals related to what we just did or what I'm handing back, go ahead and upload evidence. And so you'll have, I'll have kids who are taking pictures or uploading video or commenting on something. And that's really become much more ingrained in what we do from day to day. Their degree of self-analysis has, has really evolved. And that is, that is totally due to fresh grade because they can go ahead and take a look at all the evidence up until that point by looking back over their portfolio and really be able to connect the dots in ways that they didn't used to be able to. And especially being the eighth grade year after they've used this in all subsequent years, their level of sophistication is really amazing. I, I think about my own evolution with using it and how I used it before. It was effective, but I've certainly grown and gotten better. And so I, I think it provides many different ways for you as, a, as, a, as a, a, an educator who works with kids to try it, get your feet wet, figure out what works for you. I know that I use it in a very different way than other educators use it, um, even other members of our team. And it's because we each figure out a way that, that, that it works for us. And the same is true with, with our learners.